there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is going to be on Rap Snitch Knishes uh, by MF Doom. It's a cool track, I've done a full playthrough, so if you want to hear what it sounds like, um, go and check that out. I'll leave a link in the description and a card above, so go and have a listen to it first, and then in this video I'm going to teach you how to play that. Just before I do though, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video, and I'd love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Uh, and if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put it on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Now, the song starts kind of strange. It actually starts with a little um, bar of two beats, which goes... And then from then on, it just keeps repeating um, like the same sort of part. There's two little um, extra variations, which I'll, I'll show you all of it. Uh, but let's just learn this first bar to start off with. There's only two beats in, a, in it, and it goes. So for that, we're playing E17 and bending it up a full tone. And then you play E17 normally. And then E15. And slide down to E14. So I'm using my first finger on that 15. Slide down to 14. So you've got. And then play B15. Then G16, and then B15 again. So you got up to speed, slow down. Okay, so that's the very first bar. It only happens at the very beginning, and then it starts looping from where we are, bar two. So let's go into bar two, uh, and actually let's learn or let's hear the, that, the rest of that line. So we've got. From bar two, you've got. So for that, it starts the same as bar one. So we've got the bend on the E17, and then play a normal E17. E15 slides to E14, then B15, G16, and the B15. So that's the same, the first two beats of bar two go. And then you're going to play B17 and bend that upper tone. And then play B17 normally. B15, slide down to B14. And then jump your finger up a string to G14. And then D16, back to G14. So beats uh, three and four in bar two from that bend on the B17 goes. So the whole of bar two, you get. Okay, up speed. Slow down. And then bar three, we've got two bends on B17. And then B17, pull off to B14. And hit G16. So you've got. And then two pre bends. So you're bending G16 up before you hit it and play it and drop it down. And it does that twice. And then to finish off the line, we've got G14 and hammer on to G16. So it goes. So bar three, um, hold it bar three slowly, goes. So let's put bars two and three together. We've got. And up speed. Um, just while we're here, let's put that extra bar, because it only happens very at the, like, at the very beginning of the song, at bar one. Uh, so we'll play from bar one all the way through, so you get. Uh, but like I say, when it keeps repeating around, you just go repeat back to bar two. Let's go on to the next line, and we've got. So for that, we've got B16, E14 to B16. So you go. 
And it does that again in that bar. So you go. And then into the next bar, we play B15, E14, B15, E17. So you go. Then E14, and then E17, and E17. So from the beginning of the bar, the first two beats, you go. Then E14, another E14, E17, E14, E17, E14, E17. So you go. So the whole of bar five slowly goes. Bit faster. Up speed. So the whole line goes. Okay, so let's play from bar two. So we're going to play the two lines, but we're going to play from bar two, uh, which is where it repeats back from. And we play it nice and slowly. Here we go. And up to speed again from bar two. Here we go. One, uh, sorry, one, two, three, four. Okay, and so that the bars two, three, and four, and five, they repeat round three times, and then there's a slight variation on the fourth time round. Uh, so, the first line of this is exactly the same. So that's the same. On to the next line, and it's exactly the same uh, on the next line, up to beat three of bar nine. So it starts... So that's exactly the same, and then we go to E16, and we play it twice. And then E16, E19, E16, E19. So you got so a little change on there. So bar nine goes. So the whole line goes. So that's a slight variation on the fourth time round, uh, and then on the fifth time round uh, it starts the same. So the, this line's the same. And then the next line is exactly the same, apart from the last four hits, you just play G16 four times. So we play bar 13, go. Uh, so it's only a slight little variation, uh, but that happens on the fourth time. And then you just go back and play the original uh, riff uh, or the original melody, and that keeps repeating around. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, press the notifications, it really does help. Give me a like as well on the video. That helps the video hopefully get some more views. Um, don't forget to watch my cover of the song. Um, I love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to su uh, support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put it on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Also, if you're going to go and buy some gear from Reverb.com, I've got an affiliate link. It doesn't cost you anything, but it helps the channel. Well, thanks for watching this. I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.